Aselson announced on its Twitter account that the Goker weapon system is ready for duty. In the shooting test in the video, EOIR on the mast and Aselson ITER anti UAV system were used. Within the scope of the shooting test, in addition to the fixed wing target UAV, targets representing clustered infantry and armored vehicles were shot. Today's air threats include a class of small, mini, and micro drones, devices that are inexpensive and readily available compared to other aircraft. The devices in question can be used by terrorist elements in base areas to obtain intelligence information by taking photos and videos, or for offensive purposes. With conventional air defense systems using relatively high-cost interceptors, missiles, guided ammunition, etc., it is not possible to provide cost-effective physical destruction needs against swarm UAV attacks. For this reason, the use of low-cost interceptors and high-efficiency barreled weapon systems as the last layer of air defense is becoming a greater need. Considering the geography of our country, the land defense needs of fixed facilities in the border regions are increasing day by day. Attacks against such facilities are frequently carried out in the border regions of our country. The Goker project being worked on in this context is the 35mm multi-purpose weapon system which offers the most cost-effective defense against current air and ground threats, blending the experience of a Selsun in previous projects. It can be used against UAVs and enemy personnel attempting to infiltrate. In the MOX T-35, which will also be used in the Aselsan Korhan weapon system and introduced at the Saha Expo 2022 fair by Aselsan Konya, besides the stripless ammunition feed, it can program the Atom 35mm particle ammunition through the electronics in its barrel. Apart from atom ammunition, the T-35, which is compatible with other conventional ammunition such as HAY and APDS, will also have an important place in the YNZHA project. Among the platforms on which the T-35 can be applied, there are land, sea and air platforms. With a weight of 220 kg, the T-35 is approximately two times lighter than the Orlikon KDC-02 gun currently used in the Korkut Low Altitude Mobile Air Defense System.